So here we are in Microsoft Windows 8. I've done some theme rearranging, but I'm going to show you something that I've activated and I hope the microphone can pick up on this. Let me turn up the volume. Submit button, tooltip, password, password field. So you can notice now that it's talking. I've got narrator running, so let's log in. Hidden, hidden, hit, hit, hidden. Hidden. Welcome. Start. Start menu. Pane. Focus on mail. Launch mail. Non-selected. Draggable. Collapsed. Column one, row one. All right, so as you can see, we've activated um, Narrator, the Microsoft screen reader. And we're going to go ahead and move around. Now, in case anybody's wondering, the shortcut key, um, I believe it's Windows plus volume up. The trouble is, there's no volume up that's mapped on my Macintosh, so I'm going to need to essentially be creative. But everything works here. We are in the Metro interface, and if I arrow around... Internet Explorer. Mm. People. Photos. Weather. Store. News. Desktop. Happy Geek. So the speech is Launch a little bit... Happy Geek. Non-selected. Draggable. Expanded. Column 1, Row 1. So... The, um, the speech is a little bit broken because of the amount of taxing I'm doing to the processor. But let's go back to IE. Weather. Internet Explorer. Now, if I hit space... Internet Explorer. Selected. Command bar. Menu bar. And I can hit tab. Unpin from start. Menu item. Pin to taskbar. Menu item. And I'm arrowing Pin around to, to, these, bar. to these other options. Uninstall. Open new window. Switch to all apps. Menu item. We'll do all, all apps, apps in a second. Let's get out of here. Open new window. Account picture button. Internet Explorer. Selected. Launch Internet Explorer. Draggable. Column 2, row 1. So to go ahead and start Internet Explorer, we press Enter. Enter. Internet Explorer. Window open. Internet Explorer. Window opened. Bing. Windows Internet Explorer. Window open. Bing. Windows Internet Explorer window. Focus on enter your search term. Editing explorable text. Window opened. Bing. Windows Internet Explorer. So let's go ahead and type in... M. Microsoft Narrator. Mm -hmm. R. Microsoft Narrator. Bing. Editing explorable text. I apologize for those um, buzzing sounds that you might be picking up. Those are from my phone, and I'll uh, address that in a, in, after the video. Back button. Address. Editing explorable text. HTTP colon slash slash www.bing.com slash cert. Stop go refresh button. Pin to start button. Page tools slash app available button. Space. Down arrow. Down arrow. Up arrow. Tap. Tap. Okay, this is the first time I've done this, so right now it looks like these menus. Down arrow. Down arrow. Escape. I don't know if they're usable or not. Hmm. Tap. Explore today's homepage. Link. Bing. Link. Enter your search term. Editing. Ex search button. Link. Window opened. Desktop. Value HTTP colon. Preferences. Link. Tooltip. HTTP colon slash slash www.bing.com slash account slash general question mark Russia equals 
you get the idea. So let's actually try something that's not of Microsoft's own doing. Alt. Let's go to Google. Address. Editing. Explorable text. Page. HTTP colon slash slash. Google search button. Editing explorable text. M. R. 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 Enter. Microsoft. Microsoft Narrator. Wikipedia. The Free Encyclopedia. Result Details button. Tool tip. Hear text read aloud with Narrator. Windows. Microsoft. Result Details button. How to disable Narrator. Microsoft. Result Details button. Windows Server Forums. Link. Management. Link. Narrator and Speech Recognition. TechNet. Microsoft. Answer Disable. More result. Windows Vista. Result details button. And I'm just tabbing through all of this. To get to the address bar, I used Alt D. Alt. Address. HTTP colon slash slash. And to close it Alt. out, we want to go to Alt F4. F4. Start menu. Pane. Focus on mail. And then what we're going to do is we're going to go back into Internet Explorer. Internet Explorer. Because normally if you... Launch Internet Explorer. Non-selected. Draggable. If you just go back to the start screen, it's going to leave you where you were um, as far as the web page goes. However, if you close it, like, you, like I showed you in the last video, for those of you who haven't seen it, take a look at my thoughts on Windows 8 and Surface. Mm -hmm. I'm going to hit Enter. Enter. Window opened. Internet Explorer. Window opened. Bing. Windows Internet Explorer. Window opened. So, you can Window see opened. that we've reset back to the home page. Let's get out of here. F4. Start menu. Pane. Focus on mail. Account picture button. Space. Account so, picture. You can see that I've got Change. everything here, lock. so I'm going to go ahead menu and lock item. this. Mail. Windows sign in. Pane. Focus on Windows lock screen window. Launch mail. Non selected. Draggable. Collapsed. Column 1, row 1. Windows sign in. Pane. Focus on password. Password field. Password. Submit button. Sign in options. Link. Space. Password. Ease of access button. Shut down. Submit button. To sign. Password. Pin. Sign in options. Link. Pin. Ease of access button. Tool tip. So I was just Ease tabbing around there, and when we got to the pin or password, I just arrowed around, left and right. Shut down button. Shut. Restart. Menu item. Tool. Restart anyway button. Tap. 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 Okay, that window's not reading. It's essentially saying that if we restart now, then my account's going to be closed because I didn't really sign out. Shut down button. Short. Ease of access button. To. Sun. Tap. Pin. Leg. Tap. 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 Password. Hidden. Tool mm -hmm. tip. Submit button. Sign in options. Password. Password. Hidden. Mm -hmm. I think from here we're going to shut down the system. So we press tab to get to our virtual box or account information. Account picture button. Pigeon. Oops. Account picture button. Space. Space. Change it. Lock. Sign out. Menu item. So now I've signed out. And we should have focus on the lock screen, although Narrator um, is having issues um, disabling or enabling itself for the lock screen. I still haven't figured out how to do that. 
Anyway, you get the idea. Microsoft Narrator is um, fully usable within Metro as it stands, and you can you can navigate it. You can see there are apps that are usable. Amazon is usable. Um, so I think things are looking up. What do you guys think? Thank you for watching. Comments are welcome, and have a nice day.